Petrangelo shooting. The Oilers get their sticks in the way. Puck not cleared. Second opportunity. Dry cycle. Moving to the gaping open net backhander and he misses on the far yeah. side. And he took a high stick afterwards and I think it was from Petrangelo. Dry comes down. right after him. And they're going at it now in the corner. And Petrangelo has taken a lot of checks, high sticks, cross checks, you name it, throughout this series, and he dished one out here on Drysaddle late. And it was a late after the backhand attempt by Drysaddle as he tried to put it into the open net. McDavid didn't like it and came right in there. And they go at it a little bit as everybody converges back. Obviously, six players on the ice for the Vegas Golden Knights. And Petrangelo's going to get the gate for that one with 127 on the clock. But here it is here. Now, it's late. This is gone, 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 and he comes down aggressively. I mean, that's a hard slash up into the high area arms of Dreisaitl. Really undisciplined for Alex Petrangelo, who usually is composed, but he's just had enough. And I mean, that was... That definitely comes down. They called it a major. They're going to review it. I don't see them taking that back from not being a major. And then McDavid gets in there, coming to the aid of his good friend and teammate. Dreisaitl kind of just shaking his head after that one. It's been a sticky series in that regard, hasn't it? I mean, there's been a lot of chop and a lot of hacking. Yeah. Um, the White Cloud slash on Costa before they fought. I mean, there's been a lot of that throughout this series. They've dished it out. They've taken some. And for Petrangelo, it's just him finally boiling over, I think. He's taken a lot. Edmonton has targeted him. They've been all over him. And he finally said enough is enough in a 3-1 deficit with a minute and 27. Gonna lay the lumber on Dreisaitl, but he gets that one up high. And I think the, the fortunate thing here is that he doesn't catch him in the face. He catches him in the face here with that chop. And I think he might be looking at supplemental discipline. I would have to agree with you, Louis. That there's the verdict from yeah, the officials. It's the right call. It's the right call. And I think for Petrangelo, he understood what he was doing. He was at his wit's end as far as what has been going on with him and the Oilers. And like I said, the only, it, was the, it was a two-handed slash down hard into the arms of Dreisaitl. He doesn't catch him anywhere in the face or the head, which would change that completely. But it stays as a five-minute major. And listen, this is some of the tension that Petrangelo has gotten from the Edmonton Oilers. And Dreisaitl has had his fair share of shots on him. And this is a little bit of payback. And this is Evander Kane gets the stick up on him. Yes, he had a penalty on that play, but he has taken a lot in this series. And he finally had had enough and dished it out. And that's the chop right there on Dreisaitl that gets the five-minute major in the game. And so the temperature continues to rise in this series.